How's everyone doing? Welcome to Bruce Sees All YouTube channel and thanks a lot for the support guys for checking out the research. Um, you know, it's because of you guys that this channel is up, but the support can't stop. There's not many people that know about my research. Not many people actually believe in the research. Um, you know, it's, it's a lot to take in for some people. It's understandable. We were fed different lies. And now we have to try to go over those lies and depend on amateur astronomers and some of them are a bit gaga, I get it, you know. But as ridiculous as it sounds, um, there's people up on the surface of the moon and I'm here to prove it. Uh, before laughing, before uh, discrediting me, take a look at at least a video or two and I'm sure you will find it interesting what I'm getting. It's, it's true. There's clouds on the moon, there's UFOs, and now flashing and blinking lights. Very, very, very surprising. But not for me, because I see it all the time. I literally see it all the time. Guys, I got a gift. I, you know, I got a gift, and I, I have some certain people that have sent me gifts before. Um, very rarely, you know, Crazy Penguin has done it before. A couple of other people. Uh, Benoit, Monfire, my brother, sends me... Um, gifts all the time. He's an amazing person. I mean, I'm getting so much support from people. But I want to share with you guys, it's Christmas. Somebody, hey guys, you like candles? I'm so relaxed by this candle. My mother gave me this candle. It's a Himalayan salt candle, and it lights up and it glows, and I just think it's incredibly relaxing. That's what I have on when I'm doing my research. The only light that's on is usually that. Check it out, guys. This is an alien head. It's a head of a gray alien. It's actually green, though, that you can see. And this can be ordered at the SAC, the SAQ in Canada, which they never have had before. So I don't know. Is it sign of, isn't that cool? A gray alien head. And here's what it says in the back. It says, will I be able to read it? Meteorite filtered for a vodka that's out of this world. Wow. And it's... Oh, it's actually written USA. So it's from Grove Village, Illinois. Okay. I guess Canada got some. I think it's pretty cool. So it's a gray alien <laughs> vodka bottle, which is pretty big, close to close to life size. Thanks for that gift. Man, I greatly appreciate it. Very, very thoughtful. I thought it was pretty cool to have up. So a lot of new things, guys, coming for January because I'm going to be doing this full time, so I'm, I have a lot, a lot of footage that I'm going to be able to show you guys different techniques and a bit of the same of what I was doing, but a lot more details and maybe longer videos. Um, I'll get time to do live streams. I'll have plenty more time, plenty to answer the comments. It's something I regret not being able to do. Like at the beginning of my uh, YouTube channel, I was always able to answer every single comment for the longest time, almost up to about seven or 8,000 subscribers. Then when I hit about 20, 22,000, I had a hard time answering all the comments, but you know, I don't want these comments to stop. I mean, I think my mother goes through so many comments and she calls me and tells me, Bruce, did you see what so-and-so said? Look this up, you have to go and thank them. You have to go, they're so kind, you have to go sub to them. So my mom's actually involved uh, with the channel a lot. And I love you to pieces, mom, for doing that, for helping me. You know, it's nice to have my family uh, involved. And they, and they are, you know, they're watching my videos and stuff like that. They know it's so controversial themselves. I mean, it's not something you really broadcast to the neighbors, you know. My son has a telescope and he's actually finding UFOs on the moon. But I don't understand why it's not interesting people more than that. I mean, come on, aliens on the surface of the moon? It's nothing hard to believe. I mean, I am using a 14-inch telescope, and we're zoomed up on the surface. We're inside of the clouds, and we're actually seeing clear enough proof that there's something on the surface. But people, you got to understand, we can't clarify a cloud. A cloud is a cloud, but they move over. I mean, 
we get to see under that veil. John Lear. Guys, those of you who do appreciate John Lear, look him up. He's on YouTube. He just opened his channel. Who doesn't like watching old Super 8 or VHS tapes? He's going to transform all his past and all the uh, tapes and Super 8s that he has. He's going to transfer them all to into DVDs. Get them up uh, live for you all for free on his channel. Even him flying in Vietnam, some missions and stuff. This is a bunch of stuff that John Lear is going to do that's pretty awesome. For those of you who don't know him, he's the godfather of ufology. Look him up. John Lear. So, on the moon. I don't know what to say more to get you guys to really believe me that I'm doing this legitimately. I gotta get more people interested in the research. And I owe a big thanks, I owe all the thanks to the community members because it's because of you guys that these videos are being shared, by the way. And I'm, I was looking through analytics and I think uh, you guys have shared uh, my video, I think over 4,000 times. It's greatly appreciated. And those 4,000 times that the videos were shared, not by me, but by you guys, they wind up on other platforms. And that is the whole idea. And that is why I'm able to slowly climb and always slowly climbing. There's no big jump. There's no millions of subscribers coming by. That's okay. I tend to think that I'm definitely being silenced. For the videos to remain at 2,000 sometimes, and it has been quiet for Christmas, which is normal, probably very normal. But just to let you guys know if you want me to continue this and do this full time, it is now more important it's important more than ever now to share these videos and to keep coming back and supporting the channel so that the channel does get some attention and I really greatly appreciate it. Um, December 22nd. Happy holidays everyone. The holidays are coming up. I'll have other videos up with uh, even during Christmas Day. I'm going to be online. I'm going to be here uh, talking with you guys, maybe maybe getting up a live stream because I have an, uh, my Apple computer now and it's not the same. I have to download some other programs to do the live streaming and, um, you know, it's just a big hassle sometimes doing the live streaming, but I can also do it by on Google Hangouts. There's different ways that you can do the live streaming because you need several programs and then you have to have all these pages up while you're doing the live stream, you know, it's not always easy and live streams sometimes lag and they look pretty bad, but... Those of you just arriving that want to know exactly what you can see here on this channel, I have the proof of UFOs and what I'm doing is I'm filming them live and I'm so pressed up against the surface, it's overwhelming people because we are actually under um, literal cloud cover. You know? Now, the volume change is going to be drastic because it's another audio extension. You understand I was filming myself with the camera to show myself and this footage was filmed with my DSLR, the Nikon. D3400. So of course there's going to be a difference in the volume. So just adjust the volume. I'm going to shut up anyways and get some music up because this is just some nice footage. Let's go see the Apollo 11 moon landing declared site really, really close. Beautiful mountainous regions, color. And listen guys, the color of the surface of the moon, that greenery, I don't think it's minerals, and it is definitely not chromatic aberration. The structures or objects, natural or not, themselves are actually the ones that have that color. The color is the structures, the objects, and the surface of the moon. It's not chromatic aberration in any way. Yes, it could have to do with some minerals, of course, because I don't have any proof um, against that, and I don't, I don't want to have any proof against that. I'm not even interested in that. I'm interested and the ones up there roaming around. And we're going to see a lot more of them. Thanks so much for the support, everyone. A lot coming over the holidays. I'm not going to be stopping. I have videos up every day and a lot of research.
Thank you.